Okay, shout out to Feather Puke because she asked me to see what lilac and green looks like. So this is for you. I decided to do the primrose stitch because I've got a little cousin called Primrose and I love her very much. And she's actually slowly learning how to crochet too. So shout out to you, Prim. The colours complement each other so well and really do stand out. I think this stitch is beautiful, it's very unique and I'll also show you later on in the video on how you can adjust this stitch too. So you can go into the front loops of the middle double crochet from the cluster that you make or alternatively you can go in the back loops just to give that stitch the extra texture and to make it pop. To keep these tutorials under a minute, I have to obviously speed up the videos, but if you would like a slow motion video, do let me know because these can be posted on my YouTube channel. Here's the finished stitch here, the primrose stitch, and that's without any modifications. I think it looks like flowers, it's so cute. I hope you can tell the difference because I switched the colourway around, but in the second one, I went through and done a front post single crochet in the middle of the double crochet cluster. This has given it so much texture. 